Among Us, a simple game of Mafia in space where your goal is to do tasks, find that imposter, or be the imposter to try to kill everyone. Now, that sounds like a simple game that anyone can fast, and for some odd reason, got the most attention. Truth be told, I never heard anything about this game until I saw YouTubers like Ben Moss Gaming, Fair Riser, Mark Fair, some call me Johnny, and so many others that were starting to play this game or YouTube videos, which, if it wasn't for them, probably wouldn't get a lot of attention. However, I didn't start to get this game until Circuit Toshiku and Ice want me to get this game so we can play it on Ice's screen. So, not to be left out, I decided to get the game on Steam, which is around 5 bucks, or I could have gotten it home, which is for free, but I think he said that uh, did it on the computer's best option, so I decided to heed their advice. I uh, started playing it on Ice Stream, and I have a blast. In fact, I was starting to get a little addictive with this game. Whenever somebody else wants to play it for their live stream or for fun, I was like, all right, I'm hooked. I want to play it. And when I get addicted to the game, I sometimes get a little loud, which has the habit whenever I get too excited or when somebody's talking over me. <laughs> uh, sorry about that, Mom and Dad. But how? Out of all the games, out of all the video games I've played, why did this simple game got me and everyone hooked? Well, let's talk about it. Wrap yourselves in, get the task list ready, because we are reviewing Among Us. It's jam time. Believe it or not, Among Us was not created this year. In fact, this game was created around, drum roll please, June 15th, 2018, two years before it peaked into popularity. And the genius behind this game is none other than Marcus Bollmander, Horace Willard, and Amy Louie, the three musketeers of Inner Sloth. You probably also heard from them of their other game, Henry Stickman, which I'm going to get to that game when I get to it. So, you might be wondering how come it took two years to reach into popularity. Well, there's just one short answer. Poor marketing. Uh, people were aware about this game when it was released. In fact, only 50 to 30 people played this game, and if you crunch those numbers, that's not a really good sign. They were planning to give up on it, but those small groups of people suggested that they should keep working on it. So they did. Bit by bit, it slowly reached the popularity worldwide and reached to the highest peak to this year. In fact, they even changed the title Space Mafia to what we know today, Among Us. <laughs> How ironic that I call it a simple game of Mafia in space. But enough talking about the history of this game, let's talk about the story. So the story begins... What the... Yeah. What do you mean there is no story? Huh. That's weird. I... Uh, guess we skip to the gameplay. By the way, how did you get... <clears throat> So, the game is simple as this. Join with at least 10 people go around the these 3 minutes. Do your task that needs to be done, and try to survive the game from the imposters, which their goal is to basically kill everyone. The controls are evolved with a simple mouse and keyboard, or just mouse if you prefer it that way, or if you are using phones, just using your finger. You go to the corresponding room, you need to do the task. When you do the task, the task maker fills up. Once the task maker fills up to 100%, the crewmates win. Every task is different from one another. Some includes pressing your ID number, fixing the engines, 
throwing the trash out into the chute, or even swapping your key card for your very first time. It all depends on the map you're in. However, doing the task is also very risky, as you'll be in vulnerable in the hands of the imposter. The imposter will try anything to kill an animal, sometimes killing someone who is all alone, sometimes by framing someone by killing them in front of them, and then vent away to a different room acting all innocent and having someone be framed. Sometimes by sabotage at any moment. Lights, oxygen, reactor, you name it. Thankfully, the downside is that the cool down. In the area, the sabotage, they have to wait until the is cooling down. You can't go all kill mode anytime you want after all. That makes it way too easy for them. The imposter could be anyone. Could be you. Could be your friend. Could be your own mother. Could be your own dog. Could be even be me. Could even be someone in this room. It could even be. Once the body is reported, or if some goes for the big red button, the game turns from point to click this full conversation and vote who is the most suspicious. Or what everyone calls it now, they says. Whoever has the most votes will be yeeted into death's embrace. I stress myself to say this. Be careful on who you are voting for because it might also be a grouping too. If you vote for the wrong person, that also means the imposter will be closer to win this game. The imposter will try anything to stay alive, placing the blame on another grooming, their own one possible, high possible evidence by self-report, or trying to tell white lies to the imposter. So what happened? Okay, where was the boy? Okay, I was coming to electrical. I was also on my way to electrical. Uh, where? Okay, who? Who was it? The last t uh, person in electrical. Hmm. You wouldn't see anyone popping out anywhere unusual. Uh, everybody's muted for some reason. And that's because they're they're probably chatters, or they have themselves I'm muted. Dead. Okay, so who's last back? I'm gonna skip Oh, what? Are you kidding me? I'm not Jam, the suspect. Jam. I mean, you are in the rat. You are a suspect. If you explain yourself there. I'm sorry, what? what? Hey, what did Jam Frog do? Jam, I saw what? you Jam. murder that guy with cold blood. I saw you. What? What are you talking can about? I. I, uh, can I, can I, can I, I, I would never. This? Jam. No, Jam, Jam. Hello, buddy. Why did you run away from O2? Oh, when that you... is super oh. sus. I run the other way. Uh, Cafeteria, why'd you run all the way to the left side and not to the right? I was going to do my task. Mm-hmm. Jam. Uh, Jam. 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 It's, it's game over for you. Just give up and at defeat. No, I didn't do it. <laughs> I've been, I, I been framed. I've been Me framed. I've been framed. of you. <laughs> I, I've been framed. <laughs> Trust me, guys. <laughs> okay, don't say the effort to me. I know it was you. I'm terrible oh, with oh, lies. Awesome. Alright, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> ice, 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 in the ice, 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 ice. It's ice, it's ice. No, it's not no, no, me. No, I literally no. just got to the hallway. Yeah, I'm sorry. I just saw ice kill him. Where's Poof? No, I think it's Jam Frog. He's sitting there calling, he's sitting there crying wolf. What? I literally just got to the hallway because my two tasks are down there. Uh, and he's just like shouting out my freaking There's name. I haven't even done anything. Wait. We're lost. All right, we're fine. Just I think it's just I just think it's Jam Frog. He's trying to like call me out right off the bat. Oh, why is no one laughing? I voted Jam for you. Yeah, so did I. He's why sitting there freaking laughing? screaming yeah, my name like I did something. Or don't die. Oh look, see. 
<laughs> oh my god, what? Well, that didn't wait according to plan. Which I'm terrible doing at some time. I always stick to the truth so much, it's hard to make a lie from the ground up. Not to mention how stressful it is as an imposter in the spotlight. A flip up, your pot has a knife in your hand. Until I realized that telling the truth is also my strength too. And by telling the truth, I mean half of it. You are dead by whatever means. By both or being killed, you can still help out tasks, or if you are an imposter, help your partner to kill someone in full blood. If one side of the group feels unfair, no worries. The person who creates the group can adjust the settings where there is more tasks to do, or can throw in another imposter if they would. Even move up the speed to make it go by fast. You can even change the map to a different one too. I just wish that there is an option where you can pick random instead of just exiting out of the room to change the map. That way you don't have to be picked out of the room 24-7. I'm just saying. Despite the simplicity, it's very good music-wise and presentation -wise. That's all I could say. It's cartoony and I like cartoon games. Alright, so it's not groundbreaking, but it's not the way it is. I just wish that I could say the same thing with the room. I normally prefer playing with friends more with strangers because, well, one, it's more fun with friends, but two, you don't know if someone's following the rules or trying to or, or even hacking for that matter. I mean, yeah, you could, like, kick them out if they aren't following the rules, but I still prefer playing with friends. Not to mention, you have to either go to the North American server or the Europe server to join the, those certain public rooms. No, across the world, sadly. Because I don't know if it's just me, but the server doesn't have at least a queue at the end of the code for the private room, there's a chance that no one's able to join. I don't know, but it happens to me too. And also, no voice chat, which is understandable. They don't have voice chat options on phones from the car at all. So you can do that by creating a voice chat on Discord or Skype. Even if that's not an option, you can communicate by typing on that box during the voting sequence, or if you are dead, hopefully in the Mountain Mist 2 there will be a voice chat option instead of counting on this or texting. Maybe a better server that can read for what, but I'm okay. There's some. Like, seriously, there's no achievements, no secrets, nothing. I mean, it, there is costume to pets, sure, but you have to use money to buy them. So uh, I don't count them. Nothing to see them. Ah, <sighs> final. Among Us is a very simple game that I think anyone can play, and I recommend anyone to get it. Is it simple? Yes, it's a simple game. It's nothing revolutionary. It's not something amazing. But it's a very, very good game to play, and I recommend anyone to play it. Were there some problems with it? Yeah, I mean the, the server should probably need a little bit better. I'm having a war on the world, I guess you could say, instead of just picking different regions. And, well, maybe having a voice chat option instead of counting on Discord or Skype, just in case. But, all in all, I think this is a very fun game to play. I recommend to get it on computer, but if you want it for free, you can get it on phones. So, those are my thoughts. What about yours? Do you like the game, or do you think the game is being sus? Place your comments down below. So then, this is Jeremiah from GemFrog35 saying stay jam-tastic and stay safe, folks, and have yourself a ribbit time. Excelsior! <laughs> oh, great. The lights ran out. Oh, hey, Red. Oh. <laughs>